not till 2020, okay. yeah. Um, I just, you know, I know I have a few more years left in me, um, mm -hmm. but I don't know for four more years because right. there's a lot of up and coming new mm -hmm. young guns, and I was one of them back in the day, but now I'm one of the old veterans of the sport. Um, but yeah, it's definitely been great just to be here and to compete on the annual field. It seems almost odd to be old. Thanks. You're not old. Yeah, I know. 29? Yeah, 29, yeah. But in this sport, yeah. that, were you one of the older runners? Today? Uh, definitely. Okay. Um, and Alicia, Maggie are all older okay. than I am. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely up there. But it's sure. just nothing but a number, really. I mean, you know, I can still run with the best of them, and so. You know, just trying to to get myself back in that uh, mix again was was fun, but yeah, I just didn't have it today. Hey, Mrs. Start, what's the difference between you now and the last couple of years? Like um, when you were your best? I was training full time, 100% with OTC, living here, um, running professionally. Just that's it. Now I'm working two jobs at Oregon State and then at Trader Joe's, so I have a lot more on my plate. Um, I went through a divorce last year. I was just just a few things in my life kind of changed a lot since I was 23 in 2000, you know, or 25, sorry, in 2012. So um, definitely, you know, I, it's not an ideal situation what I had to go through the last couple of years, but, you know, I still stuck through it and persevered and still in it despite, you know, all the setbacks in my life and just things that I've taken on that I never really had to, to be a part of or do when I was just training full time. What were you saying about 2020? Um, I said I probably won't compete till 2020 Olympic trials, so this will probably be my last trials. Um, so, yeah, it was, but like it was next year, you think you'll still be competing? or? I think so, yeah, I'd love to. Um, I'm with Brooks for the next year, so yeah, I'd love to just come back out on the track. It's what I love, um, but I definitely need to make some adjustments in my own life if I want to compete with these girls. You mean just run? Uh, yeah, I'm definitely healthy. It's just being on my feet, working two jobs. So what are your, what no are your, what are your jobs? I work at Trader Joe's a couple times a week as a crew member, and then I work at Oregon State for, as the director of operations for the women's track and field team. So I'm in the office there, and then go to Trader Joe's at night, trying to drive here for workouts. Um, so just juggling a lot in my life. So. So who's coaching you? Um, Ian Dobson with Team Run Eugene here in Eugene. So. We talked about it a little bit, but you feel like